Do you ever... Do you ever get the feeling that you're being watched? Like someone is just like over your shoulder watching you. Ah! Welcome back everybody to season two of Jacksepticeye's funniest home videos. I'm surprised they haven't taken us off the air yet. That they can't take us off the air because this is YouTube and all media sucks. YouTube is the future. We can do anything here. I just killed him. Funniest Home Videos is the series where the brain goes to tickle itself. Everybody else on the internet is too busy throwing shit at each other all the time. This is the safe haven. This is where you can come and just relax and watch something and have fun. You know, it's like a Marvel movie. You know it's not going to be bad. You know it's going to kind of be the same thing again. But you're going to have fun anyway. Ah! That one <laughs> really hurt my hand. God damn, I need to be easier on myself. I'm the whiteboard, I'm sorry. Mwah. Motherfucking no one cover your motherfucking hand. I've seen a different version of that. I've seen the original version. It's like when you fucking happy, you motherfucking motherfucking no clap your motherfucking hands. You know what the weird clap? The Ken French guy. Kent! Oh, I hope he looks at me like that in the bedroom. Kent French, or as his friends like to call him, Toast. French Toast. He has the world record for fastest clapping, or at least he did. I don't know if he still has, but that was the... You know? Nailed it. <laughs> the look of disdain in their face. Actually makes me chuckle. One of the few TikToks that actually make me... I'm not going all the way back there to slap it again. Do the fucking work yourself. This is the version I saw. This is the first version that I saw, and I like it more than any of the other versions. If you're fucking happy and you motherfucking know what clap your motherfucking hands. If you're fucking happy and you motherfucking know what clap your motherfucking hands. If you're fucking happy and you motherfucking know what and you really yes. motherfucking want to motherfucking show it. If you're motherfucking happy and you motherfucking know what clap your motherfucking hands. But I also hate that shark TikTok account because 99% of the other TikToks that they produce are garbage, and I should know. 99% of the stuff that I produce is also garbage, so it takes one to know one. Oh god. <laughs> is he dead? I think I saw his soul leave his body. Oh my god, what a clatter. I can hear that. I can hear it reverberate inside my own head. I want to see it at half speed. I'm obsessed with this clip now. <laughs> Bam, 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 bam. <laughs> can, <laughs> Robin, can you edit in the special victim unit sound with, the, with that twice? Thank you. I took my sister's vape. This only has 2300 views. You guys suggested this one. Hey guys, so I strongly encourage you guys to do what I'm doing. I found my sister's vape <laughs> and I'm taking it away from her because I saw all the stuff that happened on the news with people dying and you know she's throwing a tantrum right now, but <laughs> Oh, I feel bad for laughing at it. <laughs> you know what? I had asthma, so I'm allowed to laugh at this. She just really liked the floor. She just wanted to be closer to it and have fun. <laughs> Come on, kid! <laughs> it's gonna happen again. <laughs> oh, the poor kid! <laughs> it just kept going. That's perfect slapstick comedy. Jesus Christ. These are the best types of clips. You know, he's not really that hurt. His pride is more hurt than his actual head is. It's like, okay, once, shame on you. Twice, shame on me. But the third and fourth time it happened... You, sh you can't, you can't Hello. I'm here to tell you about a revolutionary new product called Cumdon. What exactly is Cumdon? Well, Cumdon is an ancient Indian herbal and well-being tonic. 
reformulated and tested for safety by NASA astronauts, <laughs> I think it's safe to say there's never been a better time to get cummed on. Oh, come on. But don't take my word for it. Getting cummed on makes you smarter. <laughs> come on. Okay. Fake advert. Where can I get cummed on? Once I got cummed on, um, I got not one boyfriend, like six boyfriends. Okay. Okay. It's not that funny. It's childish. It's juvenile. Don't suggest this shit. It's stupid. At Jacksepticeye's funniest home videos on the Jacksepticeye Variety Channel, we have standards. It's kids getting hit with bins. None of this stinky garbage. It's too, it's, it's trying to be too funny. <laughs> oh, yes. Damn, that's good. God damn, Nick. That's right, Nick. Your body's a temple. Stay pure. Dirty, stinky, Beth. You're lucky he even let you hold hands, Beth. That's also a sin. They have more. They have more. I used to have dark thoughts and hear screaming voices in my head. Is that Ben Schwartz? Lovable American comedian and voice of Sonic the Hedgehog in the new Sonic the Hedgehog movie? But thanks to the mind melter, I feel completely pineapple. One pill <laughs> a day, and I no longer have to tickle Fritz in my pants. Just remember to bark at your doctor and make sure it's homosexual for you. Mind Melter reacts to proton imbalances, allowing for an infinite amount of side effects. Other brands Ew. like Goliapin, Floopy Boopin, and Hunky Doogie don't offer any effects. Health risks like <laughs> crying and masturbating are encouraged, but are often unappealing to small women and large children. Avoid driving at large machinery if you are ugly and pregnant, or risk double pregnancy. Remember to consult your prescription to see if the number seven is right for you. The Mind Melter life might change. Millions of plebles use Mind Melvin Clay. The time of taking burger to behave the cable's way is the syntax <laughs> error of 39 <laughs> days. Cable Gay. 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 Oh my god, it sounds like me trying to record a let's play sometimes. My mouth just doesn't words. Hey guys, welcome back to the video. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello, this is great. Welcome to the Great Wall of Sheba. You have been challenged to answer our riddles. If you get all answers right, you may proceed. What is a Sheba's favorite drink? Oh god. Um Boneless Water, Beepus, Sprunt, or Fat. I love a big, nice ice cold can of Beepus. In our Beepus? Yeah! Okay, riddle the first down. What is Sheba's favorite snack? Ramen, sushir, nuggers, or shrimpo? Um, I'm gonna go with the sushir because I actually call sushi sushir sometimes. We're walking by, he's like, oh, you want some sushir for dinner? I'm a child. This a hard one. Nugs? Damn! I can't enter. Okay, final. How does Sheba feel when bamboozled? Sad boy, surprise, sober, he hap, angry. I think do a heckin' surprise. Surprise, sober, final answer. Sad boy? No! You may now proceed. Oh my god. Is that, is that it? the hell did I just watch? I can't proceed though, because I got all the answers wrong. Fucking no! I have a riddle for you, at home. In Jacksepticeye's Funniest Home Videos, Episode 4, Season 1, what was Jacksepticeye's catchphrase? Was it A, speed is key, B, like a boss, C, or D. The fitness gram pacer test is a multi-stage aerobic capacity test that progressively gets more difficult as it continues. The 20 meter pacer test will begin in 30 seconds. Leave your answer in the comments below and you may be able to proceed to the rest of the video. Okay, a lot of people sent me this one. It's a New Zealand decking advert. I've, I've been sent this more than any of the other clips this week. If you're like me, you find it very hard to keep your dick dry. I left my dick unprotected, and it was warped out of shape in no time. I could barely recognize my own dick. Imagine <laughs> that. 
Then I discovered Schaefer's New Zealand style dick sealant. <laughs> I get it, because he's New Zealand, and he says deck like dick. I used to be too embarrassed to invite people over to see my dick. But now, my dick's the talk of the town. <laughs> Instructions unclear. Poured hot coffee on my dick. I even have pictures of my dick. Check out that dick. I want to send this to my secretary. Barbara always loves to receive my dick pics. Okay, okay. Once is funny, twice is, uh, it's getting there. Three times, okay. You've passed, oh, you're still going? Okay. I get it, dick jokes are funny. His wife is always on my dick, begging me to know the secret of my perfect dick. It's like, it's one joke, pummeled into- Well, I was gonna criticize it, but isn't that what I do all the time? <laughs> but you see, it's funny when I do it. Wireless for 20 bucks a month. <laughs> that's not right. It's right, all right. Now, chunky style milk, that's not right. I choose chunky style milk because it has the wholesome chunks growing kids need, unlike smooth style milk. Save some chunks for me. Mm -hmm. Oh no! Oh, that's disgusting! Ah, oh, Jesus! If there's any other reason for people to already hate drinking milk more. I personally love drinking milk. I love the taste of it, I love the texture, I love that sweet, icy, cold boy. Put chunks in it though, and you're Satan himself. Oh, that's not right. Kind of like your wireless bill. Mint Mobile is easy, online, and just 20 bucks a month. That's a clever ad. I like that a lot. Also, isn't Mint Mobile the company that Ryan Reynolds just bought? I want to see Ryan Reynolds drink chunky style milk. That's my challenge to him right now. You know, because he watches all my videos. This is the commercial that made up a brand new word for the English language called gaffing. It's gagging and laughing at the same time. Hey guys. <laughs> you want to hear music out of anything you got? Wow. Boom tunes. It turns Whoa. everything into a speaker. Now that's hot. Boom tunes. Right <laughs> now that's hot. Can we just meme that? Just put that at the end of anything. The fitness gram pacer test is a multi-stage aerobic capacity test that progressively gets more difficult as it continues. The 20 meter pacer test will begin in 30 seconds. Now that's hot. Boom. It's a speaker. A kitchen table. Boom. It's a speaker. What? It's what it wasn't. Even your sneaker. Boom. It's a speaker. Sneaker speakers. Wait, but if you have a music player already, just play the music through that. I don't want to attach something to my phone and then stick it on something to make it a speaker when my phone has speakers in it already. The magic is in the Boom Tunes vibration pod that sticks any place and transfers crystal clear sound full of treble and bass. It's stick on sound that lets you get down. Yeah, don't play the music from your car or from your device. Stick the device to the car and now you have sound. What happens if you stick it on the phone? What happens if you stick it on the music player itself? Would it just keep adding feedback loop, get too powerful, destroy the world? With headphones, you can't share, but you can blast boom tunes everywhere. But, but then you can't walk anywhere. The idea of headphones is that you can use them on the go and you get to listen to the music and you don't bother anybody else while you're walking around and on the bus and stuff. This does not replace that. Wait for it. Boom! Oh! A cereal box, a shipping box, an appliance box. The bigger the box, the louder Boom Tunes rock. Oh my gosh, she is killing it right now. That's what I want to do though, is just go down the street and stick it on everything. Like a lamppost, a car, a dog, someone. <laughs> if you're sick of listening to your grandma complain about her broken hip all the time, just take Boom Tunes on her and make music out of her. Why carry speakers around when with Boom Tunes, you can always get awesome sound? Hell yes. A whole advert of white people dancing. All right. This is the worst thing that's ever happened to me. Currently unavailable. We let you know when the item is back in stock. You know me by now. Anytime I see something dumb and slightly gimmicky, I need to buy it. Out of stock? Man, come on! I want one! Baby want his toy! Oof. One star from a lot of people. Absolutely worthless. No matter what I stuck the, the probe onto, there was hardly any sound. Don't waste your money. Bad, bad, bad. Do not waste your money on this piece of junk. Piece of junk. I put it on boxes, cans, tablets, everything. I was told would work, didn't. Worst product ever. I don't know, man. I'm pretty sure there's worse products out there. That's a shame, though. 
I really wanted to dunk my head into a bucket and hear music. Wanna hear music out of anything you got? Now that's hot. Somebody sent me this. And I I had to look at it because it's called front flip onto light tubes chairs. This is Super Yumi Two Show. Today I'll be doing a full flip onto light tube chairs. This is for Juggalos and Juggalettes. Don't try this at home. I hope you like it. Whoop whoop. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Fuck this shit. <laughs> oh my god. God, Jesus, Robin, censor that. You can't look at that. He has an entire channel dedicated to this. An entire channel dedicated to wrestle style move jumping into things. Oh no. Flying elbow drop onto microwave. <laughs> oh, my elbows hurt just thinking about this. This is Super Yumi Chicho today. I'll be jumping onto this microwave. This is for Jugglows and Jugglets. So try this at home. I hope you like it. Whoop whoop. <laughs> oh no, he sounded so defeated this time. Whoop whoop. He he knows it's gonna hurt. <laughs> Fuck this shit! Oh. oh, why would you do that to yourself? Oh. Are you okay? <laughs> oh no! Hold on everybody! There's a part two! Jumping into the microwave. How far apart are these? May 24th and now October 29th. This is not that old. This is Super Human TV Show today. I'll be jumping onto this microwave. This is for Juggalos and Juggalettes. Don't try this at home. I hope you like it. Whoop whoop. <laughs> I love this guy. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck <laughs> this yeah, shit. <laughs> <laughs> Is he okay? Oh, that looks like it really fucking hurt. <laughs> I I applaud his dedication to the craft. He he's an entertainer. He's a performer. And you can really tell that he enjoys performing. I just wish he would not hurt himself to do it. Oh, superhuman. Why? This was three days ago. Front flip onto flower pots. At least it's not breaking your elbow on a microwave. This is Super Yumi TV Show today. I'll be doing a full flip onto flower pots. This is for our juggalos and juggalettes. Don't try this at home. I hope you like it. Whoop whoop! Oh, wait for it. Get ready! Get ready! <laughs> Fuck, Fuck this, this shit! shit. Yeah! really badly after that one. Getting attitude adjustment onto rat traps thumbtacks. I don't think I want to see this one. Superhuman TV show. I'm with Griffin Paul. He's going to attitude adjust me onto rat chats and thumbtacks. No. Oh, he's got a friend so this time. I like it. Whoop, whoop. <laughs> ah, come on, fucking bitch. Oh, God. Fuck this shit. No, no, don't like that. Don't like that at all. I do not want to <laughs> At least he says do not try this at home because yes, don't ever 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 do that. Oh Superhuman <laughs> I want you to find another way of performing without hurting yourself because your heart is in it And it clearly you like doing it and your your go get it attitude is amazing Just please stop hurting yourself, but superhuman you have a fan in me. I want to be superhuman. Okay, well that does it for this episode of Jacksepticeye's Funniest Home Videos. I hope that you laughed. Probably not at the last ones, because they... They just look painful. But thank you for watching another brand new episode of Season 2 of Funniest Home Videos. We're still here, we're still laughing, and we're still kicking it. Now that's hot. Oh, that's hot. Did you ever get to the end of a video, and you just have no idea how to end it? Maybe, maybe this is the end. Maybe we'll just cut off the video mid sent Please like the video, subscribe, and buy the merch, okay, thanks.